this is the is four tons. Uh, it's a 410A refrigerant. Uh, no longer manufactured in the United States. No longer imported into the United States. So we want this to be um, serviced regularly. Because see that big can in there? That's the compressor. They don't make those any longer. And then do we have any metering devices in here. We did. Uh, condensing unit. They don't make those any longer they don't make the condensing units any longer so you want this stuff to last as long as possible and speaking of as long as possible this is supposed to be matched to the indoor air handler and it's supposed to be registered within 90 days so you want to see if you're a builder otherwise you don't have an extended warranty you only have without that you only have the warranty that the installer gave you which is for labor only and it's only for a year or two the extended warranty is important sure that the builder you know, did you right on that. Coming up here we got some siding and stuff. We got some diverters. That little hole right here. Okay. I get it. That little pipe right there. That's your secondary flow. Emergency flow donut tire for your evaporator coil for your air conditioning system. So if water is coming down over this door then you want to you want to check it out. You want Moving on along. Now this foundation has got a parge coat on it. It's kind of like a cake frosting. Just because the cake frosting is broken doesn't mean just because the cake frosting is broken doesn't mean the foundation is broken. Just because it's not broken doesn't mean that it's not. This is the pressure relief valve for the water heater. It's not supposed to discharge higher than six inches from the ground. These are control joints. We're supposed to have those. Those are weep holes. We're supposed to have those. problem here. Two different places. Two different places. And this one came back today. Now right here where the roof covering comes down where the vertical wall intersects with the drainage plane. I get it. We've got some flashing over here to keep water from spraying on our heads but see the way it's turned down there's nothing to keep the flashing from channeling water next to your wall you're supposed to have kick out flashing and channeling water away from your wall and then you've got that gap right in there you think water can curl up and go in there I do I think water will jump right off in there okay that's what I think Painted. It was painted at one time. It wasn't painted like this. It's just black pipe. In fact, it was not painted. Excuse me. It should have been painted. Protected from corroding. The grading and drainage is pretty poor over here, kind of like the other side. Moving on along. This is your laundry is going to be upstairs. That's for your laundry, your clothes washer overflow drain. Water's coming out of there. You've got a problem with the laundry. 